We're at Marshalltown Community College inside the eSports Arena where we sit down with National Junior College Athletic Association of eSports National Champion Amber Lothers and challenge her to the game she dominates with a little help from Luigi. Well, I just crossed the finish line. Didn't I win? Well, you got two more laps. Huh? Amber Lothers has been playing Mario Kart for years. Despite a few tips, I was still no match for her in the game in which she has proven to be the best of the best. Okay, how come I'm not going? Oh, okay. You could get a perfect start boost if you time okay. it correctly. At the beginning of the school year, she saw an advertisement and walked into the eSports arena and onto the newly formed eSports program at Marshalltown Community College. They just asked me, like, what games do you play? The eSports coaches watched her play Mario Kart and they knew. Amber is really something special. The college sophomore is successful with a controller in her hands because she is truly a student of the game. Amber comes in at least two hours early. She scouts her opponents. She practices like crazy. You know, everything that you would think about a champion doing in traditional sports. Amber is humbled by but proud of her national championship. She is just as proud of how well she fits in as the only female member of the esports team. It's probably here in this esports program is the first time that like in my life that I can remember where I truly felt accepted as a gamer. Amber is hoping her success is an example to others, no matter how they look or are perceived. There's a place for everyone in esports. Well, I've proven that no matter like how you identify, you can just come in and become a national champion. Amber's goal is to transfer to a four-year college or university and continue to compete in esports. Before that, she plans to defend her national championship this spring. In Marshalltown, Marcus McIntosh, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.